note, we're going to look at our famous Ozarker of the day. I know somebody's going to get this one because somebody answered this fella on your introductory quiz we did. Who knows? Okay. Millie knows Emmett Kelly. Yeah. Most of you don't remember Emmett Kelly, but... Uh, you remember, you remember when Emmett Kelly was, uh, was well known. Uh, this, you've, uh, how many of you have seen a picture of that guy before, that particular clown? <coughs> you've probably seen it. Uh, my aunt has a collection of like Emmett Kelly figurines or something. I mean, they're, you know, they're little porcelain sort of things. I'm not sure how old they are, but uh, his, uh, his stage name was uh, Weary Willie. And he developed this kind of sad clown character that he did with Barnum and Bailey and uh, became one of the most famous clowns of the 20th century. And uh, for several years, up until just a couple of years ago, the town of Houston, Missouri, which is the seat of Texas County, that should be easy enough to remember, Houston, Texas, Houston, Missouri had a uh, clown, an international clown festival uh, in his honor. I, think, I don't think they have that anymore. I think they quit having it a, a few years ago. And uh, he, he lived in Houston, Missouri for part of his childhood. I think there are actually a couple places that claim him. There's a town in Kansas where I believe he may have gone to high school or something like that that, that claims him. But uh, Houston, Missouri claims him as well. And uh, again, if, uh, had you been born a generation or two earlier, you probably would have recognized Weary Willie, Emmett Kelly. Uh, 